Jesus. I mean, what? How bad is Harvey Weinstein's stuff gonna get? I'm just so sick and tired of hearing about how bad he gets. He's just, he's horrible, you know? I just, it's just, it's horrible. The, the more I read about him, the more I'm just sick to my stomach. Speaking of gross individuals, I just watched Pig. Looking for a truffle pig. Someone stole her. I don't understand. Tell me who you are. You made the right choice being out there in the woods. There's nothing here for you anymore. There's really nothing here for most of us. Buy yourself a new pig. is the Nicolas Cage movie that you didn't know you needed or that you wanted. It's about a guy who lives out in the woods and he hunts for truffles with a pig and he treats the pig like it's a, like it's a family member until one night somebody breaks in, beats him up and steals the pig and at that point he leaves the woods in search of his pig. Um, it, it's... It's weird because you watch the trailer and you think going in it's going to be that kind of a movie, that it's going to be like Nicolas Cage going off the fucking rails. I'm a vampire! 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 Doing Nicolas Cagey stuff, uh, hunting down this pig and killing anybody in his way. But it's not. It is a very reserved performance by Nicolas Cage. One of the best performances I've seen him give in, I don't even, probably since leaving Las Vegas. I think that's the, it's it's that been that long since he's given a performance like this. That's very subdued, very direct, very to the point. There's no over the top. There's nothing crazy. It's just one of those things that you have to see. It's And, and that's why he got the Oscar. You know, because he did something amazing and he's capable of doing something amazing. And Pig is that amazing. It's not what you think it is when you watch the trailer. It is something fantastic. And it is a slow 90-minute burn. And there is not a single performance wasted by anybody in the film. It's like they, they just took their time and they did everything methodically. The uh, visuals are fantastic. The dialogue is great. The story, what you find out about Nicolas Cage's character as you go along, um, it's just, a, unless something amazing comes out in the next however many months are left in 2021, I am going to go on record in saying that this is the best movie of the year, hands down. I have not seen Nicolas Cage do this in a long time, and I... I cannot wait to see more from this filmmaker. It is such a good movie. I do not want to sit here and just gloat about the thing, but I can't not. It is that good. Um, and you know me. If I didn't like something, I'd tell you because I'm your Uncle Ron and I wouldn't lie to you. Um, I mean, who else gave you your first sip of beer? Uh, so... Go see this movie. It is fantastic. The only thing that I will complain about is the fact that the trailer makes you you think that you're going to be getting a completely different film. You're getting something, you're getting John Wick with a pig, but you're getting something completely different, and it's something that you need to check out. And I kind these are the times I wish I had somebody else on the show with me because I would love to discuss this at length. 
But for now, this is Uncle Ron's drive-in, and you're here to find out what I thought about Pig. And I'm telling you what I thought about Pig. Pig is fantastic. What are you thinking? I remember every meal I ever cooked. I remember every person I ever served. You live your life for them, and they don't even see you. You don't even see yourself. We don't get a lot of things to really care about. Who has my pig? So thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, we're going to be doing another episode this weekend where I talk about the Suicide Squad. So be sure to uh, hit that subscribe button. We hit 500 subscriptions. I'm super happy. I can't thank you all enough for your support. It means the world to me. So don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, share it with everybody. Leave a comment down there in my area because that's how YouTube finds out that people watch these things and helps to uh, spread the word. So thank you again so much. It means the world to me. All your support is fantastic. And thanks for all the great comments about the new setup. I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, I actually, um, I film on my phone. <laughs> Let's be real transparent here. I film on my phone, uh, but I have a little lapel mic and a ring light and the fancy stuff and the Camp Crystal Lake sign and the Toxic Avenger poster, you know, and, and, and things. But funny story, I accidentally called 911 trying to put my phone in the holder to, so the things I almost go to jail for, for you guys, so I can tell you about awesome films and some shitty ones. I mean, cause let's be real. Uh, not everything is pig. Is that English? So stick around the channel to find out what I thought of James Gunn's The Suicide Squad. I'm your Uncle Ron, and always remember, watch everything and complain later. We'll see you next time, everybody. Bye-bye.